Today is 25th of September. I don't know what time you're watching this in the future. Whenever you're watching this in the future, I want you to know that it's not too late to just start doing what you said you wanted to do. I've said that over and over again on this channel. Start journaling. So there are three months left in 2024. I TikTok. I made a post where i explain different things you can do to achieve your goals before 2024 ends stop waiting for 2025 and just start journaling what's up on billion gang is divine and welcome to divine's journal in today's video i'm going to be taking you through my 2025 bullet journal in this video i'm going to be telling you the reasons why you need to journal to make sure you stay tuned to the end for my 2025 bullet journal i'm still working on so that i will be done by second week of november launching the digital journal but whether digital or physical I rather much prefer the physical, but whatever you get, your journal is to help you with expression. Expression comes from writing. Compared to stimulation that you get from devices, when you are writing, you are expressing yourself from within yourself to yourself, maybe your future self, or you are writing to God. As I most people in their diaries of like, dear diary because you could be writing to your past or present self compared to scrolling through your phone or your device just getting stimulated and you're just getting adrenaline hits here and there and sometimes you even get worn out from scrolling all the information you've soaked in you're getting it out so you don't get overwhelmed by all the information you are getting like literally you can't be writing on your journal you see a recommendation from anywhere or notification pop up because you are writing down except you are using a digital journal i would recommend getting a physical journal over a digital journal so if you are journaling on your digital journal or digital planner turn off your notifications but if you are writing writing down in paper you don't have notifications you don't have pop-ups you are allowed to think from your mind not chat gpt i don't know about you but even your video editor could be recommending something to you like it is not tiktok or instagram but they are recommending a pop-up notification google play store very 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 what's the word i can't get the word i'll just pop it here the apps are just sending you notifications they just want you to have notifications and your mind to be cluttered but for journal everything is coming from within you and yes that is where the word brain dump comes from your brain dump or mind clutter is what your journal is for let's say you have a lot of things to do you can write it down in your journal you are overwhelmed or angry or frustrated or happy you can write it down in your journal it's not just the aesthetics or the prettiness of a journal but to help your mind i feel that's what the word comes from journal journey everything diary a journey a process it is a story expressing your mind like i said so your mind is not all cluttered up and scattered and can relieve relieve your mind so another reason why you need a journal is for tracking the main purpose who gets a journal in my 25 bullet journal I have your physical goals spiritual goals your financial goals your academic or career or learning goals then your relationship goals so in your physical goals you could track your fitness or skincare your hair care your water intake your to-do list your morning routines your nighttime routines you could track those physical goals the spiritual goals you could track you are reading movies you watch or movies you want to watch how much time you spend on your phone your screen time or um, emotions habits good or bad habits are trying to stop or learn your bible study bible verses you new bible verses you've learned prayer requests answered prayers your financial goals you could track your income streams track your daily expenses or monthly expenses all your bank accounts your investments your needs and your wants In your relationship goals you could track people's birthdays date ideas family your friends events plan out events for your learning your academics your career track applications awards inspirations those are different things you could track when you get your journal start tracking them little by little and i'm telling you you'll be so shocked when you see the progress you've made at the end of the year it will express itself physically i don't use manifest it will express itself physically and everybody will see what is going on inside on the outside this will come second after brain dumping and that is gratitude if not even first because gratitude is one of the most important if not the most important part of my journal because gratitude makes me understand the track and record of time basically what the journal is bookkeeping 
timekeeping if you've had journals before and you're watching this and you scroll through your previous journals and you check the date and time when you recorded or journaled that thing and you see how you've grown like you're better for it how god is still there and you're like god kept you through this time sometimes it's not just even the time is the emotions like you could make a video and post it on instagram or tiktok during that same time but having that video is different from you writing out how you felt at that time like relieving that moment i know images and visuals yeah but having you write it in words i, I watch i was watching a review yesterday netflix party she was reviewing the uglies and she was talking about how people these days are trying to make movies from books right she was like that there are certain things that the, nobody can ever express from a book to a movie you just have to feel it from the book like different from somebody placing their imagination like you just have to, is you are the one that wrote it or the writer wrote it for you to use your own imaginations so it's only you that knows how you felt and the emotions you felt so journaling it down is like relieving that emotion gratitude is so so important when it comes to journaling and if you don't know where to start you should definitely start with gratitude every day or at least every two days i just want to tell you that if you're about to start on decoration and you're in an african home my dear get ready get ready <laughs> no not just plenty for my house eh african parents and content creation mm. anyway so the next thing you should definitely take into consideration if you want to start journaling is recommendations tips and inspiration on my second channel i'm always telling people to bring out their journals anytime i'm giving out tips so you can write them down because what you write you most definitely will learn it obviously of e. having a journal you could be able to write down lots of you are watching a youtube video that is like a productivity video you can write down the steps that you need to do lots of you are watching a routine video a um how to video whatever video even if it's a skincare video and you just or a makeup tutorial and you just want to know the steps having your journal you can just write out regular makeup no makeup makeup look and you've journaled an inspiration you and you've journaled an inspiration you can try out another day it could be movie recommendations books to read places to visit so you could journal all those things in your journal so anytime you are thinking of any inspiration or inspo you can check inside your journal so anytime you need inspiration you can just go through your journal and you get you don't have to start stressing and checking chat gpt or google my dear we move <laughs> you don't have to start searching you already have something laid down for you just because you have your journal and you have recommendations and inspiration it boils down even to people you follow or people you want to be like let's say you're a content creator like people that you get inspo from or people that inspire you with your content that's basically what it is get recommendation and inspiration in your journal you made this part of this video i want to say a big 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 congratulations to you make sure you like the video physically and not just emotionally i'm working on journal i'm going to tell you guys when i launch it hopefully i'll be done before the second week of october i'll tell you when i want to launch because of you made this part of this video three more months in 2024 and that is when you're when i'm uploading this video i don't know when you're watching this in the future let me know in the comment section when you're watching this video what time what location or country just let me know in the comment section where or when you are watching this video but the important thing i want you to take away from this video is goal setting i have three months left so stop waiting for 2025 and do what you said you wanted to do don't focus on what you cannot control focus on things that you can do the activities you can do the people you can meet the places you can go to do what you said you wanted to do and with your journal you can set weekly to-do lists achievable tax weekly achievable tax follow up to your accountability partner if you're in school you can set your school timetable your schedule for the week for the month so you know when to tell people oh, this is my free time this is when i don't have free time so you can be productive i really hope this video is very helpful another reason why you should join out is for art and creativity therapy so even if you don't know how to draw visually you can write even if you are not that much interested in writing you can junk journal junk journaling is scrapping you can express yourself through art Let's say you, you do crochet and you could crotch, crochet something paste it in your journal whatever it is you can just express yourself through art and art is like therapy 
a lot of people do sleep and paint is a relieving and distressing activity this is very very good that's why i would recommend journaling for mental stress because it sets you apart from the background it sets you apart from everything that is happening to so just pour out yourself so expressing yourself through art or your creativity whether with stickers or with color pencils you know color is also a form of distress color also distresses people so ever colors or color pencils you have try coloring just like that three year old try coloring it's going to distress and relieve you express yourself in your journal like i always say at the end of these videos i don't want you to watch another youtube video <laughs> even though youtube wants me to promote them i just want you to save this video that youtube is recommending you to watch it later then you can come back and watch it when you have free time and if you have free time no problem you can watch the next video